Could you tell us a little bit about the relationship between you and Rampage? How everything started, mm -hmm. how you kept in contact, and how things now? Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Fabian Uyir. Um Well, well uh, in UFC uh, number 20, I fought in UFC 20, and then that same night was a, another guy called Dave Roberts. Dave actually is Quinton's uh, best friend from Tennessee. And uh, after that fight, I invite David to come to uh, Los Angeles to start training with me. So Dave came to Los Angeles, he started training with me, and then as he was training there, he told me that he, he, got, he was, uh, used to have a very good friend that he grew up with that has a big potential to be a big, good fighter. And I said, like, okay, so go ahead and bring him, you know, bring him to LA. Let's give him a chance to become a fighter. And then it was Rampage. And so, long story short, I started training him, and I, I got opportunity to fight in King of the Cage. I fought in King of the Cage, and, and one of my demands to fight in King of the Cage, I asked them to put Quint as, as well to fight. Yes, Marvin Eastman. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, and it was a very tough fight because, again, Mar I, it was Quinton first fight. Marvin have you know a lot of fights, and Marvin is a very good uh, kickboxer guy. And so they went on decision, but they give the decision to Marvin. But after that, he did all the fights to, uh, for King of the Cage and King of the Cage for Pride and Pride to UFC. And then it's the Quint Rampage Jackson that you know. What we can expect from Rampage in 2014? Well, he's very focused right now. He's back in hungry and healthy. So, uh, you know, to tell, he's 35 years old. From 35 to 30, you know, to 35 to 38 was a very strong years in, in, in my in my life, and I believe that he's ready to uh, to have that as well. You know, his knee is healthy; he fixed his knee, so it's not bothering him right now. Uh, I believe that's gonna be, uh, you know, the, the great uh, rampage times coming back. You're coaching any other fighters? Uh not at the moment. I, I did coach you know, a lot of fighters before. I coached Tito for almost eight years, defend six belts with him, and uh, Rico Rodriguez, uh, a lot of UFC guys. Uh, but not at the moment because uh, last year I opened uh, a TV channel called My Combat Channel, and it's another channel that called a Fight Network that is available in different countries. And that's what I've been working on. Could you send a short, a short message to the fans in Germany? Guys, keep strong, keep training. If you train, train hard, believe in your dream. Because believe me, we came from all different parts of the world. And if you're training hard and if you have a big heart and you believe yourself, you can make it happen. And if you're a big fan, you know, keep follow up the sport. This is a great sport. And keep in mind that this is a very, very hard sport. It's not a fight only. It's a very, very hard sport. Thanks for your time. Thank you, guys.